Living things need water to survive. Animals, including humans, need fresh water to drink. Plants use water to make their own food and to stay healthy. Fresh water is water that is not salty. It is found in ponds, lakes, rivers, streams, and glaciers. What are some characteristics of each of these fresh water sources? A pond is a small body of fresh water that does not flow. A lake is also a body of fresh water that does not flow. A lake is usually deeper and wider than a pond. Streams and rivers are bodies of fresh water that flow. Streams are smaller bodies of water that flow into rivers. Rivers are usually much wider and deeper than streams, and the water from rivers eventually flows into oceans. Glaciers also hold a lot of Earth's fresh water. Glaciers are big masses of ice that form when snow falls and doesn't completely melt during the summer. When more snow falls and builds up over time, the snow becomes very heavy and turns to ice. This ice moves like a very slow, frozen river. The water cycle affects these freshwater sources. What is the water cycle? Well, when water evaporates from ponds, lakes, streams, and rivers, it rises into the air. Once the air cools, the water condenses and forms clouds and falls as precipitation. Precipitation can fall as rain, snow, sleet, or hail. Over time, rain and melted snow flow back to the lakes and rivers. All over Earth, water is always moving through the water cycle. Seasonal changes also affect freshwater sources. In the spring, when the temperature gets warmer, snow begins to melt. Melted snow forms streams that flow into rivers and the water levels rise. Many places also get a lot of rain in the spring. When it rains, pond and lake levels rise. Glaciers are also affected by seasonal change. If temperatures get too warm, glaciers slowly begin to melt. All of Earth's freshwater sources have different characteristics and are all affected by the water cycle and seasonal changes.